Hey plant enthusiasts, welcome back to Gardening Glory. Today, we have a special treat for you, a complete guide on Xanthosoma plant care. If you're a fan of exotic, tropical plants, the Xanthosoma, also known as elephant ear plant, is a fantastic addition to your collection. Stick around, as we'll be sharing some valuable tips to ensure your Xanthosoma not only survives but thrives in your care. But before we get into the care tips, let's get to know our plant. The Xanthosoma, or elephant ear, is known for its large, arrow-shaped leaves resembling, you guessed it, elephant ears. These beauties can add a touch of the tropics to your indoor or outdoor space. Xanthosoma plants, commonly referred to as elephant ear plants, are a group of tropical, perennial plants known for their striking, arrow-shaped leaves that closely resemble the ears of an elephant. Belonging to the Araceae family, Xanthosoma species are native to regions of tropical America, including parts of the Caribbean and Central and South America. These plants are appreciated not only for their unique foliage but also for their ornamental value, making them popular choices for both indoor and outdoor cultivation. The large, lush leaves come in various shades of green and may exhibit interesting patterns or variegation, adding a touch of exotic beauty to any garden or interior space. Xanthosoma plants are relatively low maintenance, but understanding their specific care requirements, such as proper light, soil, and humidity levels, is crucial to ensuring their optimal growth and overall well-being. Here are some essential Xanthosoma plant care tips. Tip 1. Light and Location one of the most crucial aspects of xanthosoma care is providing the right amount of light. These plants thrive in bright, indirect light. While they can tolerate some shade, avoid direct sunlight, as it may scorch their leaves. Indoors, place them near a window with filtered sunlight for optimal growth. Tip 2. Soil and Potting Now, let's talk soil. Xanthosoma plants prefer well-draining, rich soil. A mix of potting soil, perlite, and orchid bark works wonders. When potting, choose a container with drainage holes to prevent waterlogging. Proper drainage is key to keeping these plants happy. Tip 3. Watering Routine When it comes to watering, xanthosoma plants like to stay consistently moist but not soggy. Allow the top inch of soil to dry out between waterings. Be mindful not to let the soil become bone dry as these plants love a humid environment. Tip 4. Humidity and Temperature Creating a humid environment is crucial for your xanthosoma's well-being. You can achieve this by misting the leaves regularly or placing a humidity tray nearby. Additionally, these tropical plants thrive in temperatures between 65 to 75 degrees Fahrenheit, so keep that thermostat in check. Tip 5. Fertilizing To keep those elephant ears flourishing, Fertilize your xanthosoma every 4 to 6 weeks during the growing season, spring and summer. Use a balanced, water-soluble fertilizer to provide essential nutrients for robust growth. Tip 6. Pruning and Maintenance. As your xanthosoma grows, you may need to prune it to maintain its shape and size. Remove any yellow or damaged leaves, and trim back excessive growth. Regular maintenance not only keeps your plant looking fantastic but also promotes overall health. And there you have it, the ultimate xanthosoma plant care guide. Remember, providing the right light, soil, water, and humidity will result in a happy and thriving elephant ear plant. If you found these tips helpful, give us a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe for more plant care guides. Happy gardening, and we'll see you in the next video.